Alright guys, welcome back. And today we got something a little bit different here. I'm about to show you guys this 1907 Morris Mini Cooper. It's a little Mini Cooper Clubman Estate and it's a right hand drive. I'm not sure where it's from, but it's definitely not from California if it's a right hand drive vehicle. I just got my hands on this car yesterday from my buddy Jaime, Jaime323 Vlogs. I got his YouTube attached right here so you can check him out. He uploads vehicle related content as well. So uh, this is another different classic sports. Not sure what type of car, but I had to bring it to the channel. There's not many of them and I've never seen them on the road. So it's a perfect car to bring to my channel, guys. I'm gonna walk around it, show you guys a brief walk around and some of the features that it has and see how you guys like the Morris Mini. It's pretty cool, it's different. You don't see a lot of these Mini Coopers on the road. But um, yeah, I'll show you guys around this car now. So we'll take a walk around, show you guys the engine and the interior, which is not much. It's it's just running and driving. It's a running and driving project. So let's check it out. So right away, you notice how tiny these Mini Coopers are compared to regular cars. So it's a Clubman Estate, so which means it's kind of like an SUV back here. It comes back, and it has back doors like a little mini truck. It's pretty cool, like a little work truck. So it just got painted, like a decent paint job, nothing fancy, just an affordable paint job to make it look a little bit better. So we'll check it out inside. Right hand drive vehicle, not from the United States, not sure where it's from. Classic looking doors, floors are there, floors are all solid. It's got bucket seats, it's got rear seats as well so you can bring your friends. Interior's all there, it's cool. Basic instrument cluster with the speed and miles per hour I'm thinking and then the temperature gauge works the gas gauge works that's how you turn it on a little loose shifter right there Let's check out the back so the back opens up handle boom pull it out doors are solid corners are solid there's no pitting or rusting doors still hold open Corners are looking good. That's original paint. Rear floors are looking good. That's my skateboard. Rear floors are looking pretty solid in all the corners. Everything's looking good. So this is a solid car. There's no rust on there or anything like that. And I think it's from Minnesota. I'm not sure. It was here in LA, but hey, it's solid. It's pretty cool though for a little Mini Cooper that has a little bit of room. Usually these things are super tiny. Close it back up. This is supposed to be glass windows, I think, but there's plexiglass in there, so that'll do for now. There's the gas fixture right there. Man, it's so small. But it's really cool to drive, really cool to drive. Classic Mini Cooper front end. I like the little headlights. Check out under the hood. So let's see. Boom. Little, I don't know how many cc's this is. I don't think this is measured measured in liters. I think it's measured in cc's. Look at that's the Morris badge. That motor is so small. Transmission is small as well. It doesn't like when you shift fast. I have to shift through the gears pretty slow to get it to go through. Radiators on the side and one belt and a generator and that's it. Cars are pretty simple. Like I said, the car is pretty solid. The corners are all pretty solid for a 1970. And I think a decent amount of people will want this car. Just because of the difference of a regular Mini and a Clubman Estate, this thing's kind of different. So we'll put it on the market and see how it goes. I'm not gonna keep this Mini Cooper, but that was cool to own. Right hand drive, you can just get in and go. Might do a POV video driving this thing, I'm not sure. Floor is solid. Corners are solid, but yep. That's about it right there. Everything's pretty solid. The roof came out really nice with the paint job. And all the glasses there, windshield wipers work. All right guys, that's it. That's my 1970 Mini Cooper Clubman Estate. Little four cylinder CC engine, four speed manual transmission, front wheel drive, and that's about it. Very simple car, but I've been driving it around here in California cruising around and it's pretty cool you know not that fast probably like 50 to 60 miles an hour top speed 
but yeah, I had to get this car on my channel for you guys to check it out. I got some more vehicles that are recently uploaded on my channel, so I've been bringing a lot of different cars on here. So I hope you guys like all of that content. Dang. That's why he charges so much for his toes. Because he got to cover it. Holy shit. There he is. <laughs> he charges so much for his toes, he might charge me to put him in this video. Yeah. Fill the brakes first. got this airbag trailer he lays on the floor Keep coming. Keep going. Keep coming. Yeah. <laughs> Just like that, the end of the Mini Cooper story for me. Will I get another one? I don't know. I'm just down and push. Yeah. There we go. So then I appreciate it, and that's it. 1970 Mini Cooper Club Minna State. I'll see what I can bring you guys next time. Peace.